Hello, my name's Emily and I'm going to be giving you a very quick Avid tutorial today. This is in Media Composer, the latest version, and it's going to be teaching you how to sync sound with picture in a very simple way. So if we have a look at my turnover bin, you can see the slate in the first frame of every shot we took, which is very useful for the assistant editor so that they know which roll, scene, shot and take it is so that you can easily pair it with the sound. So what we do is we just take this clip and put it in our finder here and then we press this button here which toggles the source record in timeline. So pressing that button when it goes green it means that this data is put into the timeline. So what we can do is just by pressing I when the slate is clapped, press the I on the keyboard, it creates this which is called an in point. What we do is we find the sound with the exact same name, open up this, do the exact same thing, add an in point. Remember that you've got to make sure that this is green in order to have this shown. And if it shows up and it looks like this, you need to press this button to show the waveform. Then once you've selected those, I like to put them in a separate bin so that I can easily see what I'm doing. So I'm just going to pop both of those clips into my syncing bin here and what I'm going to do is I'm going to select them both by pressing the command key and clicking the other option and then we're going to right click go to auto sync and click in points where it says sync clips you're using this means that it will use those in points that you just created to make sure that the two files are linked we also like to often click when creating subclips, keep audio on clip with video so that you can make sure that you can compare the video audio with the audio created on your zoom recorder for example and this means that you can make sure when you click the waveform buttons that they all sync up with the clap. So an easy way to check that your sync has worked is to double click on it and then what we do is we just press the waveform buttons here and you can see that they are perfectly aligned which means that our sync was successful and there will be no mouths moving with incorrect sound attached. Thank you for watching this Media Composer tutorial and please subscribe to the Truths YouTube channel for more videos.